there, folks. My name is Richard, and I'm trying to figure out what in the heck this little port is right here. It's on the PlayStation 4 controller. I have searched the internet. Hey, this is... find <laughs> a, a single thing on it. This is Richard, and four years ago, I made that video and uploaded it to YouTube because I got my PlayStation 4 and had no idea what that little port, that little extension was there. And thanks to you all for commenting. I got 32,000 views on that video. I called it PS4 Controller Inputs. And uh, back then, I did not know what that controller, that little EXT port was right there. Right there is where you put your headphones. So like if you're wearing headphones, you put your little, it's your little 3.5 millimeter jack. You put that right in there so that you can have your headphones while you're gaming. But that little port right there, that's also for charging. And I'll show you in a moment. This right here is where you would hook up your like, your like Android type. I don't think iPhone uses that. I think it's just the Android. I'm using a Galaxy S4 phone to record this with. And I used it back then as well, still using it to this day. So if you buy yourself one of these external um, charging bases, these Sony charging bases, you can plug two controllers on. You could take the USB port, or I'm sorry, the USB little male part and put that in the front part of your PlayStation 4 or I suppose in a phone charger, and then you can charge both of them. Then all you gotta do is take your controller, and slip it down into here and it locks right into place and it'll start charging. And basically as I go in a little bit closer, you'll see what I mean here. So when you're looking at that piece right there, that's the EX deep pit and that's the part where you would put your 3.5 millimeter jack. So once again, this is Richard uploading a brand new video for you four years later. And now we know the answer to the puzzle, the PlayStation 4 controller input. Thank you.